Question 17 is all about indices. So for part A, we're told that what is 10 to the power of 0, and anything to the power of 0 is always 1. It's the easiest mark on the test. Now, the negative powers, you've got to start thinking about reciprocals. And what I mean by that is, if we take the number 10, and a reciprocal is you flip it over. And a lot of people find that quite hard at first, because you don't realise that 10 is written like that. 10 as a fraction is 10 over 1. That hasn't changed the value of 10. So what we've actually got is this. So for the negative, we find the reciprocal of 10, so we flip it over. And what that means is the power then becomes positive. So it's easy to square stuff. So 1 tenth squared means 1 tenth times 1 tenth. So 1 squared is 1 and 10 squared is 100.